And when your car is stuck in a storm like this, there is nothing better than a tow truck coming to the rescue. They have been working overtime today, moving all those cars stuck in the snow along the highway. Denver 7 reporter Jacqueline Allen went along for some of those rescues tonight. And Jacqueline, the courtesy patrol helps people for free. And a lot of people needed help today because, as one tow truck driver told me, these roads were hairy. You can see behind me, this is I-25, one of the areas that they patrol. And you can see pavement there, but there's still snow on it. And you can see that shimmer on top. That is slick. That's a little bit of ice there, so you want to watch out for that in the morning. But if you need help, we got to ride along with the guys who will give it. It can be crazy out here sometimes. Tow truck drivers don't always get to be heroes. There's a car in the HOV. But in weather like this... It can spin out real easy. We get a lot of cars spinning out all the time. It's driver Danny Hurtado to the rescue. They could be out of gas, tire change, uh, jump start, get them off the highway for free to a safe drop site. We go along with Danny on I-25 where he leaves flyers on abandoned cars offering to tow them for free to a safe spot. But his favorite courtesy patrols involve people. We do first aid and CPR. I brought a uh, baby into the world. Really? Yes. And during rush hour this morning alone, our unlikely protagonist pulled out more than 30 cars, mostly with bald tires and drivers going too fast for these conditions. We just need people to slow down and take it easy out here. Sometimes people just need to be saved from themselves, but it's still nice to be the hero. You know, tow truck drivers sometimes get a bad rap. Does this make you feel good about what you do? Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah very much. All right, so CDOT says they will have plows out here all night long, and they'll keep going until you can see pavement everywhere. But it is possible that there will be some snowpack in spots in the morning. So what you need to do is check to make sure your car is ready. Check those tires and, of course, drive slowly. Also, Danny tells me it's important if you do spin out and get stuck, stay in your car. Someone like him during rush hour will be along shortly. Reporting live, Jacqueline Allen, Denver 7.